Hello everybody, Hammer here with a guide to collecting all of the Robco Fun magazines and the holotape games that come with them. Now each magazine comes with a unique game, but these games are reminiscent of arcade classics like Donkey Kong, Space Invaders, and others that can be plugged into a Pip-Boy or any terminal and then played. The first holotape you can find is actually located in Vault 111, and you can get it while you're escaping the vault in the very beginning, but if you missed it, it's easy to go back in and find it. Please allow me to be the first to welcome you back to Vault 111. We're going to be taking the long route, which is on the left, which is basically going back the way we came initially. You'll see that we pass through the Overseer's office, the generator room, and then finally we'll get to the recreational area. So on the left here, you can see the terminal's all the way in the back. You just go, hop on to it, and you can eject the tape. And there you go, there's your first one, Red Menace. Holotape number two is located at the Museum of Freedom in Concord. Now this holotape is actually located upstairs on the very top floor where if you haven't already gotten here you'll meet a companion and possibly one of the most annoying characters in all of the Fallout series. So just make your way through the Museum of Freedom as if you were trying to get up to the very top. You can go through the double doors in the center if you have the advanced lockpicking skills. Go through the diorama room, which is very cool to look at if you've got the spare time. And head up to the door and then out onto the right. Here we are. So right next to this terminal you'll find the next issue, Robco Fun. Perfect. The next magazine is found at Fort Hagen. Now this one can only be found during or after the mission reunions, which is a storyline mission. So you're gonna have to progress through the story a bit and you can always come back and get this at any point. Now I found that the easiest way to do it is just complete the mission. You can come back at any point and do it rather than having to worry about, oh, where do I get it along the way? Because you can climb the scaffolding in the back and then just enter through this doorway here and then use the elevator to get down to the Fort Hagen Command Center. Going down. Now that you're in the command center, proceed forward and to the right into the main command center room. And you'll notice that there is a very high-tech looking area in the middle of all this junk. Right next to the terminal will be the next issue and holotape. Pitfall. Hell yeah. Number four is located at Valentine Detective Agency in Diamond City, and I did forget to show that on the Pip Boy, but hopefully you'll know where to go for that. You can easily make a left once you get to home plate and just follow the neon lighted signs to the detective agency. Swatters, right here. Let's go. Bash is in the common room. Diamond City surplus. Everything you need. 
Once you're inside the detective agency, you'll proceed to the desk in the back right, not the type to turn and there away, underneath the lamp only one person. is the next so thing of Rob Go Fun, just... with my there personal favorite, Zeta Invaders. Pile up. And finally, number five is located at the Memory Den in Good Neighbor. Looks like we got another freak, just won't fit. Just enter the memory den, proceed out into the main area, and then go to the back left and proceed down the stairs to go to Dr. Amari's laboratory. Once inside, on the left, on the table here, you'll find the last issue and game. Grognak. Excellent. That's it, guys. Thank you all for watching. I hope this guide has been helpful, and I hope that you have a lot of fun playing these games. I know that I certainly have. If it has been helpful, please leave a like below. If you have any suggestions, requests, or feedback, please leave some in the comments section. I'm always happy to receive criticism. And if you'd like to see more Fallout 4 content in the future, feel free to subscribe to Hammer Games. That's it for this video. I'll see you guys in the next.